Are you going to resign as First Minister? No, Colin. I fooled you all, eh? All of you make-believe journals on YouTube. Why? Because... Because it was funny watching you all scrabble about, copying each other's stories, playing political games, just like the rest of the clowns in the cardboard factory. I nearly choked on my bacon butty, it was that funny. Anyway... I'm here to promote affordable housing for people I'm bringing in to displace the natives and make Scotland brown again. Have you considered your position though? Just to reiterate, I'm not resigning. I'm fighting and I'm going to win it. You haven't even thought about resigning? No, I just told you that. Look, Cole, are you no listening? I said no. I'm winning the vote, as I've always won in the past, because I'm just great. And the people see that. They see me as a leader of great integrity. Thinking about stuff is really overrated. It didn't help Peter, or Nippy, or Colin. I just carry on doing stuff for my peeps and guys. Sorry, I meant Scotland. So you will know at no point resign before that conference vote, which could be next Thursday. I just are you dense, man? How many times do I need to tell you I'm no resigning? You are all fooled, you tools. <laughs> We'll be fighting it. I'll fight it. I'll win it out the park. All right. You'll need to get the support of maybe Ash Regan to win that. Is that okay with you, given that, you know, not long ago you said she was no great loss to the SNP? Well, look, Colin, I'll be telling every other party leader exactly where they stand and what they have to do to help me run this country down quicker than a Tesla battery. We will still govern as a minority. I watched Minority Report the other night with Tom Cruise and got some pointers from that. So I kind of know what the others are going to say and I can bring out the dossier on them if they don't fall into line with my plans. That includes... Ash and her pan of dirty secrets. Confident are you that you could win that confidence vote next week then? Super confident. Come on Colin, I'll be listening to me. I can and will can win, win that vote. I've told you man, I got some cracking pointers from Minority Report. It's all about minority government. I just need a, yeah, one of I those tank say, women. You're thinking you're going to retain the confidence of the parliament. At the moment, you seem to be struggling to retain the confidence of your own party, your own cabinet even. That's not true at all, Colin, and quite hurtful of you to say that. You seem to be pushing back a bit here. Are you want to keep this job, you ginger tosser? Talking of heart, did you see Dwarf Harvey's face? That Canadian bit of the ginger boy greeting on TV. That's, That's why, why I'll be out to the Green Party as well to say, look... How do we make minority government work? I'm going to be the bigger man, literally in Harvey's case. Not so much in Lorna's case, though the jury is still out on her, stroke him, and throw them an olive branch to see if that triggers them some more. So I would urge them to read... They will see my way as the one true path to zero Scotland. I will be the leader going into the next general election. The signs are there, so should you. Thanks, Colin. I'm great. That ginger tosser needs to go. What a pest.